This is Sophie Heller, and this is an ACT reading question. The question is asking us to best describe the writer's technique in describing these different types of experiments on heat and cold. So we know that this is a scientific piece. So choice number one, concerned with literary form and stylistic devices, that's not going to be true. He's just giving us a straight read of the facts and different experiments. That's not going to be good. Choice one, subjective in his writing, also not going to be good because this is, this is about specific scientific facts and experiments. Um, objective, so yes, the opposite of, of subjective. He's just presenting facts in a clear-cut way, not providing opinions, just this is what happened in the experiment and this is the phenomenon observed. So that's going to be good. Um, choice number four, presenting facts which are new to most scientists in the late 20th century. So these are interesting facts and they might be new to us as readers, but we, we have no way of knowing if they're new to scientists in the late 20th century. So this is too much of an assumption to make. So choice three is the answer.